Right then, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to be playing some more Crusader Kings 3 tonight. Let's uh, get on with it. So, we're on the main menu because um, I am going to start a new playthrough uh, because I finished the Intrigue 1 effectively uh, the last time I was playing. I, I created Hispania, which was my plan. Um, in fact, hold on, we're going to load this save a moment because what I did off stream is... Uh, I finished up Hispania. Well, I did that on stream, but off stream I finished up getting the uh, all of Catholicism around there to get that uh, achievement for getting all of Hispania a Christian thing. And I found out a couple of things about that as well, which is quite nice. Is that if um, if you do have like someone like this in control of a county and they do have a, a religion, it will actually convert it. I guess they put their own um, priest or whatever to work because some of the counties down here were converted by the time I was finishing count converting others so that was kind of cool but yeah I got that achievement so that's nice so we're going to go back to the main menu and uh so yeah my plan we're going to be playing um vikings yep oh yeah there we go right yeah we're going to be doing a viking playthrough um what I would like to get I'm actually looking at the achievements uh like there's what I want to do, which is to I think it's conquer all of Britannia as one of the sons of Ragnar Lothbrok. There it is, yeah, yeah, conquer all the British Isles. So yeah, Blood Eagle. That's what we'll be going for for this playthrough, at least. So that's kind of the plan. So um, I did a little bit of looking into it, and I know that Vikings play a lot differently. Well, tribals, I should say, just in general, but specifically Vikings. Uh, and that's what I wanted to do. I was originally planning to play as Hafton here, but I noticed that he's actually feudal, which is interesting. He starts as feudal, which is not what I wanted. So uh, I'm going to be starting as either the bonus, who is actually tribal, because I want to I want to do a tribal playthrough. See what that's like. We'll try and figure out Vikings a bit. Like here he has a duchy, he has a fair bit of land. I think we'll kind of do it. That's our aim, though. Take care of the British Isles. I can always try like another. Um, I can play through at some point as well as someone smaller somewhere over you know in actual Scandinavia but hey this is my plan anyway for this one for now so let's um get on with this week I'm a mode let me check game rules let's just revert to defaults in case anything was different so yeah I have the bonus now there's one thing I might save scum right at the start is that while I was experimenting looking at all, all these various people I noticed that sometimes Ivor starts with skill points and sometimes he doesn't. I don't really know why. But like if we don't get one, then we'll uh then we'll just start another game until we actually get some points. Because I think it's a bit wrong in my uh lifestyle marshal. Okay, we got a couple of points, cool. Alright, so yeah. All right, so so straight from the start. Let's go look at lifestyle because it makes sense. Because we are going to be doing martial. That's my plan this playthrough is I'm going to learn martial. I want to get... I want to understand the combat better in this game. I want to try to enjoy the combat because apparently it's, it's, it's good if you do. I never really enjoy it in my playthroughs that I've done so far though. It's just not so exciting. But uh, we've got a decent perk to start with. Cass's belly cost reduction which is nice. Movement speed for all our mans. That's pretty sick. So uh, that's pretty cool. So I think... Uh, I'm probably either going to go for authority or chivalry. But my, well, I've got twenty intrigue as well. That's kind of crazy. I didn't realise my stats are like that. I have more more intrigue than martial as either. Crazy, but okay. So, hmm. also, I'm going to throw it out here. I'm actually drinking a little wine tonight. I already drunk some earlier. When I had my uh, wonderful dinner. Um, but I'm drinking a bit more. Because why not? Normally I don't stream too much on Sundays. Because I like to chill. But hey. I'm in the mood. So. Alright. So we do have some intrigue. We could probably put that to use for murdering and stuff. We have that. We have a lot of children. We have one heir. Going to get everything. This son is going to get. The Duchy of Man. Right. 
We've got a lot of dudes. Okay, yeah, that's pretty good. Um, let's have a look at our military. We need more champions. Probably recruit this guy to start with. Get him in. Get like as many champions as we can. Like, how, how am I? I'm not in this list. But my my prowess is pretty solid. How much gold is this going to cost us? We actually start with 540 gold. That's quite a lot. Six gold. I'm, yeah, okay. Let's recruit this mad lad as well. Three gold. Awesome. Right. Okay, so yeah, lifestyle then. So we'll, I don't think the pure marshal is very good. We either want authority, focus, or chivalry. I'm thinking chivalry might be the best. But martial might be decent, like some extra control growth, dread gain. Now, I like the idea of chivalry. I think what we want to do, these are pretty decent, but I think we want... We want to get stalwart leader from Gallant and go down to Knight Effect Nuis because uh, more knights. Because I know that knights are good, particularly for uh, tribal. They're not knights, are they? They're crusaders, are they? Champions. Yeah, just flavor text. So that's probably what we'll do. We've got some special soldiers, a bunch of mans. Cool. That'll figure out. What have we got here? Nominate successor for the Kingdom of Alba. Okay. I nominate me. My son. Apparently not. Can't seem to nominate anyone there. Who likes me the most? Can I? Oh, I can't even see who likes me the most on this one. Fair enough. Uh, most of these lads want this son. This guy. Oh, that's me. I was like, yeah, okay. Apparently I only have one vote strength, so it's not going to do much. Can vote for this guy who hates me a lot. I wish there was a, a range by um by who who liked me. Who's this guy? I'm gonna vote for this guy. Boom! Why not? All right. So, um. Right, so we've done that. We've looked at our champions. We can hire a court physician. Off Guthrie. Okay. Right, you'll, you'll do. Create the Duchy of Man. That's something I probably want. Fact. I remember there's a there's decision, I think. Elevate the King of the Man in the Isles. Yeah, this is something I think I want to do, because apparently this is kind of cool. Apparently you, you gain the Kingdom of the Man in the Isles, in terms of realm capital. This converts us to feudalism, which is an interesting thing, which is something I might consider doing. Apparently the title. I don't have the county. I need Living Legend. Wow, okay, so... That's probably not going to happen for a while. All right. What's this? Determine personal deity. Okay, so I could become a devotee of Odin, get intrigue and piety. Ula is martial. Thor is stewardship and prowess. Freya is fertility. You know, I kind of like Ula. Extra martial. My martial's a bit low. Yeah, let's do this. Why not? All right. The gods are many and inscrutable, yet I cannot say that there are some who hold... There are not some who hold a special appeal for me. Were I to dedicate myself openly to the express worship of primarily one such deity, I would doubtless draw like-minded souls to my side. 
Whatever the blessings my patron survives, being with similar Asatrians, can only bring me health, wealth, and glory. Alright, so we're going to go with uh, Ulara, wasn't it? Yeah, a bit more martial. I think that sounds pretty good. Do it. Cool. So, we are actually at war. Right, we're at war with Northumbria here. Oh, hey, there's some mans. There's me. Who are these guys? They're... Okay, so they're Yarl Haftons. They're, they're hostile to me, but they're not attacking me. Okay. Alright, maybe we should run these lads away in the hopes of my... Who? who my, my brother, yeah. Yarl Hafton. Hafton. Okay, so yeah, he's basically equivalent to me in his strength, so... Probably don't want to attack him. We're going to grab these dudes and run them away, I guess. Run them into the sea. 12 gold? Yeah, that's worth 12 gold. All right. So yeah, we've got East Anglia here and what's this one? Yeah, Northumbria. I think we'll focus on Northumbria because that's closest. To... We raise up some mans. Probably makes sense. Bring up our man at arms. So yeah, we'll go straight to war. I'm gonna figure when these wars are over with. We'll try and figure out other stuff because I know there's raiding and stuff like that you can do as Vikings, which sounds cool. So we'll get into the sea, I think. Whoa. How many did I just raise? Did I not raise? Oh, I didn't raise all. I'm an idiot. Alright, let's combine these mad lads. We could probably go straight to their capital, I guess. Oh, they've raised up a whole... Oh, they are. Uh, they better not be attacking me. I don't want that. If they seem to be attacking the same part that I am. That's worrying, because I would like Northumbria for myself. But hey, if my... My brother's going for it, that's a problem. I'm becoming the dynasty head of the Segurda dynasty. Okay, I'm not the Norse culture. But this is my house. Okay. Alright. We actually have enough to unlock a perk. Alright, so I'm guessing then we're going to be wanting... These are different to the others. What do we got? We got adventure, diplomatic range, sink of cost, village, prowess, naval speed, capacity. Pillage is probably going to be the one. Warfare, though, prowess, night effectiveness. Hmm, both of these seem pretty good. Is warfare or pillage? Let's go with House of Warriors. I think the prowess and the marshal will be more useful. That's kind of annoying because I would have liked to have taken Northumbria myself. White Peace. Who is this? Northumbria. Oh, no, no, no. We're not seeing White Peace with you, lad. Okay, my dudes seem to be... That's a neutral army, right. You know what? Let's do this sensibly. Let's go take this land. Uh, these lads... I don't know what to do with these. I don't know if we should attack there or not. I don't know what to do with these guys. Holy moly, there's more dudes coming in. We'll probably use these, I guess. I don't really want to attack my brother. Let's go sieging there with them. Wait, no, don't. Yeah, do that, because I don't want them to land on top of that army, because that's not going to do much, is it? This feels like... a mistake. Like, not a mistake, just... This seems way more intense than what I planned to do from the start. Do we have any siege dudes? No. We should definitely get some siege dudes at some point. Oh, I should look at one of these. Apparently we don't have any siege dudes. 
Yeah, there's no siege mans, it seems, like the origins I had before. That's okay, though. Apparently we're losing this war somehow. Are we losing the war? Ah, because the held objectives, right, that makes sense. Let's go take all this land anyway. This is all good. Anyway. Right, what have we got? So, wars we could declare. We don't want to do that yet. We could create this duchy. Don't think a guardian for my player and son. You'll get stewardship. I don't really want to do you stewardship, but... Uh, Alright. Yes, that's what he is. Maybe we could train his son to be combat related. Could create this dodgy, I guess. 125 gold. Sure. Why not? Actually, out of interest. Um, we didn't even check this stuff. Chancellor and Champion. You're better at martial. Do we have anyone better here? Spy Master. Do we have a better Spy Master? Could probably. Yeah, we'll put you into there. A marshal can be this guy. We need a better spy master. This dude at 12, I think. Any better stewards? Not really, just this guy. Right, this dude supports me. We need to make him like me more, I think. Alright. Apparently we're losing some mans to attrition, that's kind of bad actually. I think these are special dudes we don't get back, aren't they? Yeah, apparently we don't replenish these dudes. Yeah, that was a, a waste doing that. Oh man. We should get these mad lads out of here and uh, have them chill. But who is the commander of this? Me, right. Is there anyone better at sieging out of interest? Raid speed, winter soldier. No, okay. Alright. I think we'll just chill then. Where are these lads' armies? They're not... Anyway, they're, they're tiny. Oh, a curse undone. What's this? Oh. Oh, King Ayla died. He was killed by Jarl Hafton. Oh, okay. I want to you soon. Cool. Alright. Alright, so he took that chunk of land, which I was not expecting. Uh, but okay. Who are these lads? Apparently someone's helping. I murdered this guy. Alright. So I can't believe he, well, he took that chunk of land. Okay, fair enough. There is a lot of dudes all wandering around everywhere. Holy moly. Maybe <laughs> maybe this was not the best playthrough to figure out my um, first Viking playthrough. But we don't need mercenaries. So what happens to this land then, if we win? You get that? Even though my brother just took it? Wait, we got defeated? Wait, who are these guys? Wait, what? Where did this happen? I didn't see that happening. Oh, that happened now. 
Oh, okay, so we got this dude. Right, okay. Alright, well, we won this fight anyway, it seems. So uh, let's enforce demand and see what I get. Alright. So be it. We didn't get a bit of land because apparently my brother here took a massive chunk of it himself. Fair enough. Can I just ban these armies? I think we can only do that in a friendly zone. It's not a friendly zone. It's not a friendly zone. Well, okay, fair enough, right. Let's grab them and we'll go and disband them. Let's take my mad lads here. Go down to Wessex, I guess. Is this a war for Wessex? Where is... What we should probably do then. Let's go grab you lads. Take you into the sea. Go down around here. And go hit their capital, I guess. Probably a good idea. I, I disband all these dudes for now. And call them in later if I need to. Ah, swaying, complimenting um, my Hoff Guthrie. Alright. Uh, yes, um. Callous forgiving. No, I'll keep it short and professional, we won't bother with that. I'm not quite sure what, what fight that was that we lost a bunch of mans, but hey. It's all good. I don't think we need them alive. Oh, we're not sieging. Maybe going to the right place would help. We take the capital, that should be good, because like this place is Apparently they actually have a big chunk of dunes now. Wow. I don't know where all their dudes are. But hey. Oh hey, here they are. Oh no. I don't think we're getting a what Oh, bugger. Alright, so we're probably going to need all my mad lads, aren't we? So, uh... Cool. Yeah, this isn't really what I wanted to try to learn how to do a Viking, this stuff, but hey. Well, we lost the steward. Guy will do. Oh, we're above the domain of it. Oh, wow, we certainly are. That's right, because we took this big chunk of land, didn't we? Alright. Let's grant this land to someone then. Let's go find. Do we have like a really cool knight? This guy's pretty strong. He has a barony. You know what? You. You'll do. Would you like some land? Would you like all of this land? That seems a good plan. There we go. Apparently he stopped. Oh. Right. Okay, so that works. Negotiate some alliances. Yes, so Bjorn Ironside. Or Bjorn Ragnarsson. I don't know who this is. Oh, you're the guy who's got that bit of land that I would want at some point. I don't think we're allied with you. Nor you. Because uh, I do want to take all of this myself at some point. Apparently I can take a concubine. Alright. My prisoner here. Okay. She'll be my concubine. Cool. She doesn't like me much, but she's fine. Call some dynasty members. I can declare wars. Create Duchy of Lothian. I don't need to do that. Big Froth. Yeah, who are you? You're one of my sons. In diplomacy. I think diplomacy is a good idea. You're probably better at martial. Or maybe not. 
I don't know, your marshal's better than everything. Best. We'll see if we can get him to be good at marshal. But we should look at our children still. We have uh, that son. One. What about this one? You're actually good at diplomacy. So, uh, so we'll educate this one with diplomacy. Mother. Daughter. Brother, son. Not sure what to do with you. You know what? Let's educate you as a uh, marshal. I think all our sons want to be marshal, ideally. Well, that's my plan, anyway. Yeah, we should probably raise a pool of unmans and see if we can uh, get them. In fact, what I'll do... Raise them all here. Get them in the sea. Marvellous news. Hold on, that's not all I'm at, is it? Oh, yeah, apparently it is. Wait, don't I have, like, more... Duders. These guys. Oh no, apparently they got murdered a bit. That's fair enough. Where? Ah, do we have a better commander? Yeah, this guy. Let's get you guys resupplied a bit. Can I call in my allies? It's been some prestige, but I think this would be. How how thank you. Not much, but but let's do the It's a bit chunkier. We call him in, see if we can get him. Replenish these guys, I think. That might have been a bit of a waste, but probably is actually. Looks like these dudes are actually quite strong now. Right, let's get back in the sea. Go around and go hit their capital. Might be a bit bad. Oh, what's this? A helpful warning. I received a message from Petty King Article of Strathclyde. He claims that Lord Mayor Sverker, my steward, has requested support in a plot against me. There's nothing more I value. Uh, there's nothing I value more than loyalty. Articles and letter reads. Hence why I share this with you. So, uh, no, my student vassal and commander really likes me. I think. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll support him. Yeah, can't be trusted. We have a faction raised against me. Oh, it's a populist one, that's fine. I don't want this war to end it either way, really. I don't think we have enough dudes here to do much. I think if they get all their guys in, they'll attack and we'll lose again. We can get a new perk. Right, let's get a stalwart leader, I think. Let's do that. Oh, here they come. Abort. Get out. I think we're going to escape. Nope. God damn it. Oh, we lost uh, my brother. Okay, right, we lost this fight. Let's just, uh... Can we wipe peace? No, they won't accept it. 
We surrender. We pay some gold and spend prestige. Your Sigfroth placed me. Right. My nephew. Okay. That dynasty. Uh, I'm the house head of my house. Oh, he replaced me as the... Okay, right. Fair enough. No one is actually in this except for me. Where well, my ally that I just called in. That's annoying. I guess we're going to lose this. Maybe I should just surrender. Because I'm going to lose this fight anyway. Whatever. Paid some gold prestige. So be it. That's okay. We can figure this stuff out time comes. Look, Strathclyde here. This absolutely needs to be um, attacked at some point. Here we have, we have a conquer county. Conquer duchy. Okay, if we have illustrious fame, we can do a conquer duchy. That's pretty good, because that'd be like the entirety of Strathclyde. That could be pretty solid. Okay, we could... Alright, we've got a lot of things popping up. Okay. My brother died somehow. How did he die then? Gout ridden. Great. Alright. Okay, so let's see. Um, I need more prestige. I think I can create a duchy, can't I? Who's Yalsagan? What do you own? Okay, you've got a... Uh... Oh, right, okay, you're one of my brothers. Sure. Let's ally with him. Over there. Seems a good plan. We need to tear apart. Here. I think I can create a duchy, can't I? Great Lothian. Cool. We are very close to uh, the next level of prestige. That's cool. Alright, so let's look at these messages. So we've got a raised runestone. We can raise a runestone. It costs piety and prestige. Oh no, sorry, we, we gain piety and prestige. It doesn't cost those. It costs us 50 gold. That's not much. So one of my counties will either get an ancestral runestone for popular opinion, conquest for control growth, or a clout for levy size. Okay. Alright, sure. Do that. The Rocks of the Ages subject. Every runestone tells a message of some significant event in the life of the Commissioner. From the smallest peasant to a yar like myself, the stone records all. What should this monument speak of? Perhaps my vanquished foe, Elfgar. I lose stress because I'm vengeful. Or I just gain the 50 gold. Well, okay, it's got to be this guy then, because that's the only option. Alright. Now that I have decided what to put on my runestone, the question remains where to place it. Hold on. I'll read down a second. Uh, memorials to Victi, such as my triumphs over Elfgar, are a constant reminder of war's glorious end. They are best placed in areas that require encouragement to cooperate. Okay, so we're gonna go to Diflin. That would be the conquest one. Okay, these are all conquests. So I think these are all places. Well oh, that's Diflin. Where is this place? You know, up there could be pretty good. Oh that's better, yeah. There or basically, oh, in, in the Suthraya. Yeah, you know what? Let's put it there. That seems to be like my main 
area. Yeah, that's cool. Right, so what's this? Varangian Adventures. Ooh. I'm able to declare a Varangian Adventure. Okay. Duration of the tribal area is type of wars available. Start a new life in a distant land far from the cold shores of your homeland. Oh, so they re relocate my realm, but leave all my lands independent, including my vassals. Okay. Right. I don't know if I want to do that. Old Grand Blot. Okay, so this is a sacrifice thing. Cost me prestige. Gain lose popular opinion. Kind of like a faith. But it gives... So, kind of like a... Uh, beast. But it gives us faith and... Um, other stuff. So we can sacrifice someone and choose one of my prisoners. Do we have any prisoners? Um, we have one prisoner. Who are you? Just some rando. Perfect. Let's do this grand plot then. 200 prestige. Also, oh hey, we're also at the uh, next tier. Cool. So um, that means we can do that. War for the duchy. Right, the grand plot. Although smaller lot are held for many occasions through the year. Once a decade, the Asatruans of the Uthfreya come together for a grand celebration and most importantly, a grand sacrifice. Though plentiful blood is, uh, blood is shed for the gods, the meat of the offering goes to the faithful. Such a rich feast usually makes for an incredible party. Of course, such an affair is expensive and certainly not all Asatruans need to be invited. Okay. So uh, we could lose 50 gold. 75 for all of the freemen, or every lord and commoner for a hundred gold. You know what? Everyone. hundred gold. Let's go all in. It's our first. Oh, I remember reading about this, I think. You have a prisoner, you need to... No. I think you have to designate a prisoner. Prisoner. I'll figure that out in a moment. Wait, being raided. Oh no, 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 no. Wait, that's all my men out? God damn. Okay. Raise everyone. Yeah, we need to go raiding. We need to figure out raiding. Get him, get him, get him. There we go. No one raids me. Motherly advice. Sometimes I think that my mother has a better overview of my treasury than even my steward. The gold piece seems to be worth twice as much when she tells me how to spend it. Guide me to prudent choices. Again, uh, plus three stewardship for five years. Best to have a say. Uh, yeah, no, she's my mother. Sure, she can help me. Right, so I think. What, how do we stop this thing? Do we just defend? I guess. Guess so. Ah, block first. Wait, block force to cancel. What? Why? Oh. Why was it cancelled? Oh, is it because I'm in an army? Oh, man. Oh, that sucks. Oh, can I do that again? Okay, we can. Cool. Alright, we'll do that again. Although we don't have quite enough gold. You know what we need to do? We need to try ra raiding people. So we can raise local raiders. Oh yeah, oh look at all these icons. Are these places that were recently raided? Right. We need to figure out places that weren't raided. We've got all our mans here. Don't we have someone who's good at raiding? Raid speed, yeah. 
Right, so we could do the grand block, but we need some gold, because we want to do that 100 gold thing again. Apparently that's all the dudes we have for raiding, so... How do we... Oh wait, there's a loot thing here. Well, that's my land, whoops. Wait, how do we see that loot again? Yeah, range thing. I'm gonna figure this out, friends. Apparently that's seven loot. Zero. Maybe it's a distance thing. All these places have been ra uh, raided already, it seems. But it's clearly not a distance thing. Apparently these have got icons that are raided. A cool. Three. Oh, I see. Wait, it's it's the castles in the places. That's where you see the money. Okay, so there's loot here. Only bit of loot there. Oh no, sorry, it's the, it's the actual holdings in the counties rather than... Alright, yeah, you know what, let's go down to Devon and go, go raid these mad lads. We'll go raid them, them first, I guess. Apparently it doesn't cost us any gold to embark. Cool, okay, raiding's kind of cool. Alright, so let's try that blot again, shall we? Oh no, wait, we don't have quite enough gold. Start it. That'll tick over to a hundred in a second. All right. Lose a hundred gold. We'll try again. I guess I can't be in an army while doing a blot. Have wars. I'll do wars in a minute. I'm investigating raiding first game. So you're my mad lad raider dude raid speed go up 100% that's pretty good how long is it going to take? 20 days ok cool alright is there something I'm supposed to be I can hold on I can challenge someone to a trial by combat apparently he's a fornicator oh that reminds me I need to what do we have up in Realm? Look, tribal authority, disparate tribes. Characters cannot be imprisoned. Limited tribal authority. Costs 308 prestige. Alright. But we could settle becoming feudal or clan. Characters can be imprisoned. Yeah, you know what? Do that. I guess that means characters that are like our vassals or whatever. Oh yeah, first successful. Oh, we... Oh hey, we've got someone. We can ransom off. Wait, 10 gold. He wouldn't accept it. Wow, really? Nephew. Yeah, he wouldn't accept his nephew. That's crazy. Can we imprison somewhere else as well? Can we ransom you? Your 10 gold. We'd accept 10 gold for this guy. We'll keep one of these people. We'll definitely keep someone for this block if we can figure that out. Alright, so we, oh, we can actually. Mouse over these to see the raid loot. So that's four there, fourteen there, eight there. Right, let's go four then fourteen. Why not? I guess we need to keep an eye on this in case, like, someone raises an army and comes to smack us down. I think these dudes are kind of chunk. Three and a half thousand. Ah, the grand blot. A blot can be in both a grand and small affair. By tradition, they also include both human and animal sacrifice. Several prisoners will be offered to the gods, perhaps even including a special choice of my own, their lives given in tribute to the gods. Though the beliefs of the Asatru demand this, there are commoners in my realm who find the thought abhorrent, and the ceremony can proceed with purely animal sacrifices if I wish to avoid controversy. Alright, we're callous, so clearly I don't want to do these. The tradition matches the gods should taste human blood. 
Oh, optionally, my designate chief sacrifice among my prisoners. Yeah, okay, that sounds good. Apparently, we could spend more gold for everything. Now, let's just do man. One man. Alright, so we've got prisoners. We designate... You, yeah, we could. We could designate this guy. Ah, oh, both Cornish people. Well, really? Yeah, they're Catholics, so yeah, we'll designate you as a sacrifice. <laughs> They'll lose opinion of me. Oh, well, that's fine. Designate sacrifice. All good. Uh oh. Are they coming for me? No, they're not. I'll grab this bit of loot. I think they are. No, they are coming for me. Get away. Oh no, we're not going to escape, are we? Ah, oh, god damn it. My loot. I should have ran as soon as I saw, saw the army. Ah. Oh. You took my 22 gold. Rip. Oh well. Well, we'll try raiding somewhere else again. We could try this trial by combat. Oh, Grand Blot. The glass of the Blot are so numerous that they blanket the area around the temple, standing up a cacophonous roar as Thetko is dragged up to the altar, the first of several prisoners and more beasts. He thrashes ferociously as the Gothar throttles his life away, the light in his eyes lasting till the first animal is slaughtered. Human corpses to the hanging tree, animals to the cooking fire. All gore is collected in a bowl, and the Gothar use it to paint the walls of the temple inside and out. Truly a spectacle worthy of the gods. Alright, so Odin to Freya, the new author, gain a uh, prestige. Oh, so, oh no, that, that's one person. My my Hofka 3 and Court Physician will gain opinion, but like he's got a lot anyway. So uh, every invited noble, or at least count rank, gains opinion. Or every invited county will get popular opinion plus 30 uh, more popular opinion oh, let's let's go uh, for every noble yeah cool all right let's go you know we'll go sway this dude and what we need to do is increase development in where's my capital at? which is my capital it's here okay what is this ill Yeah, ill. Okay. That's that's my capital. Increased development here. Fabricate a claim. I don't think we need to do that. We want train commanders. Keep you on disrupt schemes. I could do this tribal combat. So, who are you? Who are you? A foreign ruler. You seem pretty rubbish. You might have a good champion, but still. Do you actually rule best land and other land? All right, let's try to humiliate her. Wow. No, let's get gold. We want gold. Trial by combat. I'm pretty good, so I think we should do this. Ah, so she brought in a champion. Oh, sorry, he's wor much worse than me. So I arrive in the designated spot near Reykjavik in a in good time. Oh, she's up in, uh, of course, Iceland. Wait, is that Iceland? Was that Finland? Yes, Iceland. Yeah, yeah, of course. All right. So yeah, uh, fine reference is already waiting for me, along with a small entourage of witnesses. As Chiefess Otho is unfit to fight herself, Refa has agreed to champion for her. The formalities are brief. We all know why we're here, and we're long past the point of talking. Weapons are handed out, and our retinues retreat to observe from a safe distance. May the best man win. Right. For a few brief moments, Refer and I pace in lazy half circles, each watching for an opening. I have my sword, ready to defend myself while he clutches his axe firmly to hand. This fight may only be to first blood, but that doesn't ease my nerves. With a sudden twitch, our bout begins. Unexpectedly, Refer manages to swing a vicious kick from my shin, momentarily hobbling me. Oh. Alright, so we've got medium success, low injury. High success, medium injury. 
for low success, no injury. Well, let's let's go high high success, medium injury. I leap into action, launching a flurry of quick slashes, driving myself hard against Refa's guard, wearing him down with each expertly timed strike. Spotting an opportunity, Refa lunges forward and headbutts me, hard in the face. I reel backwards, wrong-footed. Okay, so his stance is failing. We're evenly matched, alright. So, low success, no injury. Oh, I gained dual handicap rank 4, really. So did he actually, so we both lost 4 uh, prowess. Right, so we could go low success, no injury. Medium success, low injury. Or low and no. Well, let's go medium and low. My sword flows around Refa like water. Each strike chaining fluidly into the next, a series of perfectly timed attacks. That's, I've read that one before exactly. All right. Very high success, medium injury. Low and no. High medium. Now let's go for very high and medium. Single combat victory. A dramatic sweep of my sword in one direction gives way to a change of arc and a quick slash that takes my opponent by surprise. The attack hits harder than I'd anticipated. The spinning ref around it. Uh, entirely around and almost toppling him over entirely. He pulls it together at the last moment, but I've already positioned my sword to run him through. The tense stalemate ensures ensues as Ref weighs his options, but eventually squeaks out a bidding yield. I am victorious. Sick. Victory. Resting easy back in Il, I exult in my success, my sword laid across my lap. In an ideal world, I'd have been able to land the winning blow squarely on Chief S. Author. Sadly, it wasn't to be. Beating Refa to a pulp would have to do instead. A sack of silver rests against my shin, satisfying weight a testament to justice well earned. Served. Uh, I had each coin counted one by one in front of everyone before we uh, rode home. Yesterday we put our quarrel before the gods, and the gods answered wisely. They gained some gold. Rad. Where are my mans that... Uh, Retreating, here they are. We'll, we'll bring them back. We need to go raiding, we need to get gold. We also need to take this bit of land. I think we need to get... Oh well, so our soldiers are that many other men. I think we need... I need to figure these out. So what do we got? We got armoured footmen, we know those. We got Huskarls. They're a type of heavy infantry. The Varangian veterans, they're heavy infantry. They're good in winter. Bondi, they're spearmans. You know, spearmans are pretty good. I like spearmans. They're basically a slightly weaker pikeman. They cost less, but they also have pursuit and screen. Well, everyone's got screen from uh, Organized March. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Vigmans. They're special archers. Screen. Alright. What do we actually have right now? We've got a stack of Bondi and some Vigman. I, I'm thinking... Probably some more Bondi, so maybe some Varangian veterans would be good. Oh, they at least cost prestige. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. Yeah, maybe a group of heavy infantry would help. I think, much like my previous playthrough, I, I want to focus on, like, spearmans and maybe some other dudes. Alright, so let's see. Can we get any upgrades to our buildings? I haven't even looked at this. So we get palisades, improve spearmans and archers. War camps, which improve knights and heavy infantry, skirmishes and archer cavalry. Alright, more knights is probably going to be pretty rad. Markets for money, though, is also good. This stuff costs money and prestige to build, right. I think sparring grounds are probably going to be good. Focus on heavy infantry and skirmishes, possibly. 
But I think building up a market is going to help us a bit. Temple holdings. If it's only like feudal, then temples will actually be real good. Well, let's build markets anyway to start with. We'll start with getting a bit of money. Where are my dudes? Here they are. We won't today replenish, we'll go raiding somewhere. Here I could raid over here maybe. There's some nice spots down here in France along the coastline. 14 there. Oh, actually, hold on. Before even going there, what about over here? 15 gold there. Grab these. 7. That's my lands. And pop over here and just raid. I just see 15 there. How strong are these lads? They're about equal. Hold on. Before we go in and raid, we should probably. Oh, that's not my land. We need to replenish dudes. And we'll do that, and then we'll go to war over Strathclyde, probably. Take that. Are they replenishing? I'm not sure. Oh, what's this? So this smell is completely unbearable. It's been a solid month since Greta brought down that blasted wolf for hunting, and he's still carrying its maggot-ridden head around him. Everyone in Ill is sick of it, but he refuses to be rid of the damned thing. The rest of the court has finally had enough, it seems, and forced him to come to me for a verdict. Alright, so we could get... He could get 75 opinion. Who is he? He's my... Off got three. Right. He gained opinion, but everyone else would lose. He'd also get minus 50 general opinion. So I can make him get rid of it. He'd lose some opinion, but that's okay. Okay, or I can make him lose a little bit of opinion. I gain prestige. But he'd keep the minus 50 uh, opinion. Yeah, you know what? Yeah. Do that. Are you guys generating? Let's just ban you, lads. Raise my raiders. 900? This feels wrong, but I guess it's right. That's okay, we're figuring this out. Alright, what's this? Rangian Guard. By the time my rational Theothmander comes to me with his plan, he seems to have already made up his mind. Serving with the Varangians in Miklagard will bring us both wealth and glory. I cannot deny that part, but I could deny his request. On the other hand, would it be right to stop someone in their pursuit of glory? Go with Tears Blessing. This dude here, who is he? He's my martial and champion. So you go to this guy's court and you gain Varangian. We can make him lose opinion of me. Ah, you know what? Go with Tears Blessing. You want to fight elsewhere? Go fight elsewhere, son. Oh, wow. Yeah, we need um, we, we need a marshal because we're just going to re... Okay, that was a mistake. Uh, can we get a marshal some? Right. We've got some daughters. Married to us. Who the heck is this you're married to? Where the hell? Alright, can we... F Wait, isn't it... Don't Vikings be like uh, equal? And it's male preference. Gender law. Oh, we're going to lose a lot of titles on there. Uh... Succession. Wow, okay. 
I have very few people in my realm. I get the feeling I've made a lot of mistakes already. Hmm. Yeah, I need to find the only female courtiers. Guest. Is my mother married? Oh, hey, could we? Would anyone say match with anyone who's like a really sick marshal? Oh, this dude would. Marry my mother to try to get this guy to my court. He'll come to my court, I think. Yeah, okay, so now we have a marshal with any luck. Yeah, okay, great. Hooray for having mothers! Go raid that and give me 15 gold. A dangerous faction, apparently. Oh, populists. Raid or trade? As my troops and I prepare to sack the land of Ulster, our first scouts report back. Seems the local towns are rich, but many are heavily fortified, and we could well be caught out by vengeful armies before we can break into their juicy targets. All is not lost. The art of good raiding is all in sorry, is all in exploiting opportunity, and we could perhaps arrange trade and tribute in exchange for staying our blades. Alright, so I gain a hundred stress because I'm callous for doing this. I lose stress some callous and continue raiding. Or Penny Jolston refuse to think about trading instead of raiding for the rest of my life. We don't have any stress, I think. No, so let's just do this option to continue raiding. Oh, here comes the bad army. I think we might beat them. Yeah. But we're, we're stronger. So we've raided there. Is there anywhere else to raid? No, let's just go back to our lands for now. Probably fight them again, but hey. Well, we captured some uh, prisoners, though. 50 gold, very nice. Bring home some gold. Oh. Oh, some, there's a subjugation war. Between who? Uh, between Snake in the Eye and this guy. They're, sure, we'll, we'll accept, but... Uh, they are incredibly far away. Can I disband this army? There's hostile armies around? Oh. Oh, we can get some more perks. Cool. Let's get um, night effectiveness. Plus 75%. Alright, so we should probably think about attacking Strathclyde, I guess. We have the Conquered Duchy. My level of... Oh, it's my level of fame. Wait, I thought we had Illustrious. Oh, no, that's the fourth. We got up to the third. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay. Alright. Well, we could go help with this war then, I guess. Right, lads, let's go. Go help uh, my brother. Probably just go hit him straight from the, the sea. Got a tiny man of armies. I'm spend 10 gold for that, that's fine. I can designate a guardian for my daughter. What's she like? Stewardship, apparently. I think she'd be better at intro. Game doesn't think so. We've got stewardship and learning. Learning then. Yeah. Why not? A lot of wars we could do. Commander promoted. 
My Marshal Saimander has been showing off a promising new recruit. He may not be of as noble stock as you, my stepson, but on my name I swear that Ordran is someone you would want on your side. Okay, so we'd recruit this dude. He's actually pretty solid, yeah. Let's get him in. Ah, swaying scheme. Sort of professional, sure. Wait, why are we actually swaying this guy? Oh, he was... The he was my old marshal. Wait, hold on. Wait, stop. Abort. Abort. God damn it. Have you already committed? Damn it. I'm an idiot. Yeah, they, they should have won that, really. Okay, so... Oh, right there. The control level goes down, but they get increased autonomy. Which... Every county... Which faction is this? Like, I mean, which county is this? The Odom of... Inri Sothreya. Itri. Yeah, why not? Let's just do that. Just so we don't have to deal with it. Go grab my man here. Apparently we lost our spy master as well at some point. Cool, of course we did. Your woman. Oh wow. She She really doesn't like me though. I don't want her as a spy master, I think. I think we should use my mother who's kinda of terrible at it. Actually hold on my steward. Okay, you're still. Fine, we'll just use my mother, I guess. But do we have any my courtiers? We need to find female courtiers. My wife, my daughter, my woman. We could get recruit my guest here. How much would you cost? Three gold. Oh, okay. Let's marry you to someone. Matrilineal. I want the sickest spy master in the realm. You're a guest of someone, so you'll be fine. You'll join. Excellent. Here we go. Perfect. My dudes are just chilling. Go link up. They just got away, but that's alright. We siege there, we'd probably be able to. This. My brother. Oh, my mother died. Ah. Well, that's a shame. There's a little bit of. My nephew. That looked wrong, so. Did the wrong thing. What was that error sound? Apparently I became the head and then lost the head immediately. Okay. Fair enough. Let's go see if we can hit this enemy army to murder it. There we go. What's going on with this war out of interest? Let's siege that down. Going on with this fight. I think we need to help them actually. From the looks of it. I'm being raided, bloody hell. Oh that's right, I was gonna increase control in the counties, wasn't I? Raiders. Win this war for my uh, my ally here. In fact, if we can get home, we might not be able to take them down in time. Expect not. We might raid more, but we might be able to get there. 
Lothian spared. Despite successfully besieging the settlement of Edinburgh, the fortification protecting swathes of Greater Lothian, Mormaer Cumagal, has restrained his troops. The resulting looting has been isolated and sporadic. Though your vassal has been spared, Strathonian are your personal domains hungry. Oh, it just made me spend prestige. Wow, okay. Okay, I'm pretty sure we can get there and stop them. Yeah, there we go. Cool, we chased off those raiders. I need to do some raiding myself. Can I turn these mad lads into raiders? Wow. Apparently not. Alright. I need to figure out how to raid some people. Or indeed, clear war around here. But maybe Ulster over here. Apparently it's subjugation war. To make him become my vassal. Okay, that sounds pretty good. Need to uh, get my dudes to replenish a bit, I think. Yeah. Oh. Someone's declared war on me. Oh. Who are you? Gwyneth, where are these? Oh, it's down. Oh, Wales has declared war on me. Right. They're calling my allies. We oh, did a holy war on me. Cool. Let's call in everyone to help. Children like guardians, my player. Really? I thought I was his guardian. Oh, that's right. He was going for stewardship, wasn't he? My woman, sure. Son's this. Going for diplomacy. All right. Got to go deal with this war now. Excellent. Let's raise all my armies. I do not have many mans. How many mans are in this war? They've got a lot more than I do. Wow. They don't have many mans at all. I get the feeling I've done a lot wrong in this short time I've been playing. I think... Going down here maybe, hitting the castle while my allies turn up. I don't go by there, go by the sea. Go by the sea. It's only seven gold. I need to go raiding, I suppose. Okay, there's all my all the enemies cruising off somewhere. Away from my lands, which is curious. I think I could go straight and hit the capital, couldn't I? Well, they're not there, they will bug it off somewhere. Gotta hope my allies come in. Ah, oh, my player and my son is uh, a fortune builder. Stewardship. I mean, he's pretty good at stewardship. I didn't really want that, but. Uh, but okay. I could marry him off to someone. Unis is not there. Ah, yeah. Still do. See if we can get a genius done from there. If we could do stewardship for a, for a round. Might get some good children. Oh, new perk. Uh. Yeah, friendly fatal casualties down and advantage up. Sure, that sounds pretty good. 
But I'm curious, what's my what's the succession more like? Confederate partition. Right. Probably rather this son be the heir. Can't murder you, can I? Hmm. Apparently, we could go up to high tribal authority. Revoke titles and re and uh, vassals. That'd be a lot of gold. Sorry, not gold, prestige. Oh, they're going to be heading there, it seems. I need my... I need my allies to... That's so many of them. How do they have... How are they so big? That's crazy. I strongly get the feeling I've done things wrong. I think... I'm thinking once again I've gone into something too big and too crazy. Possibly. Yeah, we might actually win. We're not going to win. Uh oh. Took someone's son hostage. Yeah, okay, now we've lost this fight. All right, that's suboptimal to say the least. Right, all right. I'm gonna pause a second and gather my thoughts. So I think the most fun I had was my Cornwall party through in this because I started incredibly small. And I basically learnt as I went from there. So. I'm thinking this just throws me into way too much. Like, I, I haven't got a clue what I'm doing. As, as a Viking, because this is just constant crazy stuff happening. My, my woman is attempting to uh, romance me. Hell yeah. So I don't know, maybe I'll just start another game as a small viking, like one county, possibly a tiny duchy, and then figure it from there. Because I, I think that's always the best way for me to learn, because I'm not massively, massively enjoying or understanding this. Also, I'm ever so slightly intoxicated, which doesn't help. Because there's just too much going on. Like, there's so many places around. Right. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Like, I'm debating it. So I think I did a lot of bad decisions to start with because I don't fully understand this. As I was trying to understand, like, the Viking aspects of tribal, you know. Can I just white peace, actually? No, they wouldn't accept it. You get the owner of Diflin. Where's Diflin? That's there. I mean, that's Ireland. I'm losing land, but I don't massively care right now. I could just... Who is this guy that I... You're worth 50 gold. Could execute him. Let's ransom him off for 50 gold. For the ransom... Alright. Let's just let's just surrender this war for now. Let's 
so be it. Right, so I've got... So I've got these bits of land at least. I'm going to disband this army. Does it get a guardian? Who are you? This son. What's this son doing? Diplomacy, apparently. Plus, like... Alright, one other thing that I'm not too happy about in this place is my son, who's going to be my main heir, is apparently good at stewardship, and I didn't want that. I wanted to figure out war and whatnot properly doing this playthrough as a, as a Viking. I do kind of like the idea of starting a new game in a moment. There's like a small county somewhere under a liege. Yeah, I think... Where are my notes? I made some notes somewhere. Where are they? Um, the kings. Did I make a note on, like, if there's a start I might have wanted to do? Well, this was my plan anyway, because obviously I did it, but I don't think this is really what I want. Not right now, anyway. Let's have a look. Alright. Sorry, I'm being very quiet at the moment, friends. Let me just uh, figure this out. <clears throat> Apparently, I didn't make a note at all about any uh, other stats that I might have considered. Right, let's see. Uh, let's do a quick Google then, I suppose. Because I think I want to do something slightly smaller and more understandable as I try to figure this stuff out. I don't know why. It's just... I don't really like starting as larger things with a lot of stuff happening. I've never learned enough playing this game doing that. I've learned a lot more like when I did Cornwall. Let's have a look. Exciting Google action here. All right. So I'm not really talking a lot at the moment, friends. I'm trying to figure this out, but it's all good. Maybe I'll just carry on with this for now. But uh, you know, all right. Let's just carry on with this for the moment, and I'll figure stuff out. Maybe I'll 
Why do I need to raise my armies? Oh, it's because of that war I don't care about. We're already been raided again by someone. Oh, this dude is about to run. Cool. Right, so we lost there. Fair enough. Not that fast. Uh oh. Who are you? Well, that, these lads are already... Oh, no. Yeah, my dude is already winning. I don't need to join this war. This is alright. So... Can I raise my mans over here? Maybe intercept these... No, because they're already off. Actually, they're going over there to raid it from the looks of it. Actually, they're not even raiding my land. Who are these lads raiding me? Is, are they those guys? One of these guys? Yeah, okay. They belong to... The, so they raided me and then now they're going down through this bit of land. Apparently... Wait, more raiders? Who are these guys? Oh, that is my land. Right, so we've got two different raiders raiding us now. Cool! Yeah, this is a... Uh, not going spectacularly, we'll say. Yeah, let's go. Maybe we'll build it. They've, they've, they've gone in the sea. They're gone. Why are they raiding the same bit of land? Two separate armies. They're out of there. They're gone. We need to get them. Stop these dudes at least. Right, so we murdered those. Cool. Alright. Right, so... We need to take Strathclyde ideally, but... We don't have enough level of fame for that. Don't I have some claims? I do. Alright, cool. Good to know. But I think waiting until we have enough prestige is going to be the best land. Can I see... Created this duchy already, didn't I? County, but... Yeah, apparently I created the duchy. Right. Maybe Ulster is probably the plan. Could subjugate this dude. Comes my vassal, which is fine. I gain a chunk of fame for that as well. Okay. But I think that's that's what we'll do. Let's grab my flag. Don't get here. We'll wait until those days are... Oh, that's what we were going to do before they declared war on us and we lost our piece of island, wasn't it? Yeah, that's all right, though. So you mad lads, let's just subjugate you. We can do it with just our mans. We don't need to call in our, our allies. Let's go in, let's hit their army, hit their capital. Take some lands. Maybe my thoughts of starting a new game is like, uh, you know, give it up. So this music is banging. Oh, what's this? Of course, a populist uprising happens as soon as we uh, declare war. Including this guy. Great. Fine. And rally the troops. Where, where even is this? Oh, here, okay. Well, we'll go murder these mad lads. Siege this down, then we'll go deal with these knobbers. Oh, wow, okay, they are way bigger than I thought. Um, let's call in you for the uprising, I guess. Was he my chancellor? Well, that sucks. Oh, we have a daughter. Cool. Excellent. Double excellent. Let's see. Um, how 
Uh, let's see. I probably should go over there and deal with that, I guess. I kind of want to focus on this war, because if we win this war first, then uh, I won't have to worry about them. Oh, okay, here we go. That, ideal. Let's just do that. Enforce demands. He becomes my vassal. So be it. All good. Right. Let's go. Let's go deal with this. I don't know if I have enough good mans to do this, but hey, we'll see. I don't know where my allies are. So I need to close my blind in a second. So we have a new daughter. I think we, we might, it looks like we'll actually win. Because I think they're all just levies. Oh yeah, we're slaughtering them. Ideal. Another faction being created, my vassal and champion. Okay, that's one. Cool. We got this dude. You are pretty strong. Let's go recruit you. Awesome. This banner's army. Alright, so we have a new daughter. Wow, I just realised my woman here really hates me. I think we should sway her. Are we actually swaying? Yeah, you actually like me, so that's fine. Right, let's see. Let's, um... Right. I saw in my notes that there was a specific building I should build. I need war camps. War camps are priority number one. Oh, we did build a trading outpost to get money, I remember now. Construct a war camp then. Alright. Cool. So let's see. Uh, we've got a lot of victories. Ransom someone. 10 gold. Door. Apparently, I can uh, trial by combat someone. I have low county control. Oh, that's right, I remember that. Hmm. But so we have a daughter. We find you like a rad, strong dude. Can I stop? I can't find anyone by prowess. But you have real good prowess. You're good. Just marry you. Get him into my court. Help me fight good. Right. Oh, we're going to be right back very quickly, friends. We're going to uh, pause. I'll run a 30 second ad. I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. Hello. Right. They're not raiders, are they? They're just some dudes. That's not even my land. I need Strathclyde. I need to get more prestige. So I could probably do, like, Meath next, I guess. Couldn't subjugate him because, uh... Oh, it's only one subjugation war a lifetime. Oh, he didn't tell me that. Oh, okay. Okay, can't kill this place. They're actually pretty strong, so probably not. A Leinster. Yeah, that works. They're kind of weak. Sitting there's probably a good plan. But what about anything in Northumbria?
Oh, this is piety. But they're similar. Yeah, my, my mans are not good. I need more good mans, I think. Alright, so let's have a look at... Whoa, hello. Mouse pointer. Yeah, I think if we get a set of Varangian veterans... Oh, that, oh wow, my prestige per month is going down because of this. What size are you, lads? Three, five. So I think we're losing a lot of prestige right now, but I think when they're all reinforced, we'll stop losing quite so much. Excellent. So while that's happening, let's go... I cannot raise raiders one more. Oh, right, these wars. God damn it. Maybe I should go help with those wars. I don't think I need to. I'm pretty sure these lads are just winning solidly. Say that. Yeah, okay, there they go. Right. Let's speed the game up a bit anyway. Right, Athlon, can we declare war on you? Oh, that's the same. That's Meath again, whoops. Try to take Cornwall, maybe. Oh, wow, well, yeah, they are incredibly weak. Apparently they're currently at war defending a claim against Wessex. Which war do they want? They want Devon. Okay, so if I go over Cornwall itself, that shouldn't be a problem. If I go take the pieces of Cornwall I want, Gift of Generosity. Son Guthrif. Okay. So this son, who is Marshal, is going to get generous. Mm, diplomacy, no. Diligent, no. Patient. Okay, none of these are good for combat. For Marshal. Uh, diligent, maybe. Patient. Sure, patient will do. Probably the best. Oh, don't land on those lads. Let's get Tintadra and Launston. I don't really want to fight these dudes, because they're... Uh... Okay, they, they won. Awesome. I'm getting a new Marshall perk. Number of knights plus four. Yeah, that sounds sick. Child of my dynasty. My player and son has created a granddaughter. Cool. Hopefully they'll be preoccupied with their own war. Ah, we won that war as well. Cool. Basically, I'm just hoping they seized a bit of land they want. Well, I seized a bit of land I want. And we both chilled together, you know. And it's all good. Strategical impasse. I am sitting around the map table with Chieftain Catalan and Lord Mayor Sverker, uh, discussing our strategy for the ongoing war. Catalan eagerly points out all of the prime targets we should immediately send raiding parties to pillage, while Sverker nervously mutters about how we should avoid unnecessary engagements and fight a war of attrition. It is my right to decide our ultimate course of action. Okay, we can improve, employ both strategies, get both uh, improved pillaging and improved avoidance for five years. Cool, yeah. Nice, do that. Yeah, 
Yes, let's hope these lads do their own army. Oh. A stranger is brought before me. He has been waiting outside the castle gates for a week, my liege, my guard informs me. The man bows deeply. My name is Finnakte, your highness. I have travelled far and wide and seen many things, but I am weary of the road. If you allow me to stay, I will happily share my knowledge of the world with you and be your loyal servant. Uh, I don't really want to gain stress because I'm callous. Might be worth it. Who is he? What's his stats? He's not that great. No, he's not worth it. We have no room for him. We've got someone's wife. Cool. I'm being raided now. God damn it. Where are they? Oh, they're up there. Bug. Every time I go to war, I get raided. Fine, though. Turning from the Frankian guard. I barely recognise my courtier, Uthmunda, as he enters my, my great hall. I am home, host, Uthmunda Bellas. Bellows. There have been many a time I thought I would never see these shores again, but I am finally back. A stranger did see my courtier after all these years. I cannot deny that I am impressed with his Greek dress, his foreign jewellery, and the heavy coffer he has brought back with him. Welcome home. He's got some prestige and gold. Cool. Oh, is he actually better than my current man? No, he's not. That's a shame. It's okay, he's back so he can become my one of my own knights again. Champions. I'm just hoping I can just chill here with Cornwall while these lads do their own thing. Which would be nice. Oh, I didn't have someone who's got better besiege time, do I? No. No. Faction is nearly ready. Alright, so I own the war targets now. I'm just going to chill there, I think, and hope that I don't die. For these armies that might come down. Ransom someone. Only 10 gold is not worth it. Looks like they're coming for me. Oh no. Oh no. God damn it. He caught me, of course he did. They're not even part of my ward, just leave that stuff alone. Well, this plan didn't work. Oh, wait, pause. No. Apparently we won, anyway. Cool. Fantastic. So be it. Alright, so we got a bit of Cornwall. Brad. Don't know how we won that, to be honest, but we did. So that's cool. I'm good with that. Grab this flag and we'll go move it. Over here. We need a bit more uh, prestige. Proof of devotion. And my woman has arrived to bring me uh, honour. I can gain a wolf pen for 20 years. Prestige. Good necklace. Prestige and extraction. Red orchid. Learning and prestige. Oh, let's go for the wolf pelt. Oh, she failed. Sigfroth comes of age. Okay. My son and champion. Got a brilliant strategist and holy warrior. Wow, this dude. Okay, he, I want him to be my heir. Like, at 100%, I'd want him to be my heir. No, I don't have an absolute crown authority. I think if I get enough prestige, I could get both, though.
Oh, you can get a pet dog or a pet cat. Hell yeah. I could spend prestige and add Scandinavian elective to my main title. And vote for which side I wanted. That might make it worse. Ransom you off. Alright, so I need to raise up my my man, so I think. Two, I go raiding. Alright, hold on. Probably got some stuff we could raid down here. Oh. Okay, she's bought me a cat. Fair enough. I'd rather a dog, but sure. Alright, we can uh let's call her pause. Sure. Right, so we've got some raid dues. Six gold, four, fourteen. Try raiding there. Alright, so, uh. Oh, she might become my soulmate, this woman. Oh, wow. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, fine, why not? Soulmate me. Hi. She's, oh, okay, she's plus 33 now. Soulmate gives 120. Wow. Four gold, six gold. Tango there, you're not going to get Tango. Hold on, don't we have a better commander for this? Yeah, this guy who's Reva. Okay, he keeps fickle. Wrathful. Giving. Let's give him with fickle. Five gold. Seventeen there. There. 14 gold up there. I'll go grab that. A new Marshall perk as well. A peacemaker, I think that's pretty good. Fourteen gold, let's go grab that. That is nine. That's oh, seventeen there. We have sun. Oh. Pause. Hey, a rat free. 105 gold, 17 there, nice. Hundred and twenty-two. 
grab that 17 for the last bit. Although we only need 10, I suppose, but still. Back to our uh, raiding home of Cornwall. That's a good bit of gold. Alright, alright. Nice. Oh, and prestige as well. Ban for now. My prestige, like, almost at illustrious. Cool. Let's go see. Is there any place we can go to war with? Um, Leinster, maybe. Conquer the county. Yeah, they're weak. Cool. That'll do it. Raise everyone over here, I think. Get on down. Murder these mad lads. Oh. This neighboring ruler gained opinion of me due to my um, chancellor. That's pretty good. There we go, gain the level of fame. Cool. So when we've got this bit of land, we can go take the uh, county of um, Strathclyde. Apparently we've got an unpressed claim on an earldom as well. Nice. Well, we're being raided now. Buggy. I don't think we have any mans to go deal with that, do we? Moment. Oh, Sigtrid comes of age. And one of my other sons. But diplomacy. Well, it's not bad at diplomacy, I guess. Okay. Force demands. Be it. Okay, let's see if we can get these lads over to go deal with this, uh raid. Probably not though. Okay, so we've got one too many bits of land. Let's have a look at my realm. Yeah, realm. This is my heir. Knowing I'd much rather Yeah, this son be my heir. Never Leinster, though. Alright, let's unpause. Bug it off. More raiders turned up though, these guys. Kill them them at least. Ah. Oh. My wife wants me to give my cat away. Hell no. I'm not giving my cat up. Lost a chancellor though. Alright. Are these raiders? Are those the raiders? I don't think they are. They might be. We'll attack them anyway and see what happens. Okay, we're not actually attacking them, that's fine. Right, so next plan in Strathclyde. Where's my war? My flag over here. 11 days, cool. Well, these dudes are really close to being completely wiped out, which is a shame. Oh, raise a runestone. Oh, hell yeah, gain some prestige and uh, piety. Alright. Yeah, to my vanquished foe. Made. 
A vengeful. So put it in Cornwall. Control growth. No, let's put it in my uh, current lands. In the Inri Sothraya. That seems pretty good to me. Apparently I can pet my cat. I'll lose some stress. Oh, hell yeah, we're going to pet my cat. Yeah, I lost 10 stress. Sick. Can ransom some of 50 gold. Nice. Okay. Let's see. I want to build a war camp here, I think, for more knights and knight effectiveness. So I think I can go to war with this dude. Yeah, it's counting my allies in this. We'll probably call them in, but hey. Because like, he's got more dudes than I do. He needs to call his allies in for this. But we're going to declare war. Apparently our war is right next to their capital. That's a bit worrying, because if he raises more than I do right now, then that's bad. It always costs a lot of prestige to call him in. Hmm. No, don't go that way, you donkeys. Kill this army if you can. Okay, that's good. Now we can go kill this army. Should be ideal. Let's go siege that down. Oh, we've got... New legacy. Great. Yeah, okay. Whoever's choosing these is going along where I wanted to go anyway, so. That's good. That helps. So my son will get content. That's fine. I'm going to deal with Mon soon. Yeah, we take forever to siege things down. Which is a shame. Oh, there's a holy war. Rally the troops. Fine. Get ready to call my allies in for this holy war for free. But I can convert to my attack as faith. Oh no, we don't want to do that. Right, they're joining. New perk. Let's keep pushing down to um, Peacemaker and then Gallant. Go murder these dudes. Actually, we might not be able to. Um, seems to think we might win. Oh, we will now. My allies have turned up. Okay, out of interest. What's going on with this war? How big are they? All right, lads, let's go travel over. Go beat up this army. That's going to be a new priority. We've got a lot of war score from winning these fights with those dudes at the moment. Oh, where's the allies? Oh, no, don't lose the fight. God damn it, allies. Why didn't they join in? Where are my allies? Oh, they're there winning a fight. Okay. Losing a fight. Losing a fight. No, no, no. Abort, abort. Go away. 
We've been raided a lot now as well. God damn. Yeah, okay. Right, okay. What I'm going to do... We're going to... Jeez. No comes of age. Cool. Okay. What I'm going to do, friends, I'm going to stop there. Then It's been a short stream. But, like, I've been fiddling around a bit with this Viking stuff, and I'm not feeling this here. What I'm probably going to do is when I stream again tomorrow, I'm going to figure out a spot, and I'm going to start small and work from there and try to understand, because this is just constant mayhem. It's crazy. But yeah, uh, I'll stop for the moment. I'll stream some more tomorrow. Anyway, you all have a good night. Catch you all next time.